certain Kia vehicles offer an advanced LCD display which provides a variety of helpful information about your vehicle and its operation. The high-tech functionality of the LCD display modes can be easily changed by using the control buttons on your steering wheel. Depending on your Kia model, you may have one of these two types of button configurations with either two or three control buttons. These buttons control not only the mode, but also enable you to reset or change an item on the screen. Let's review the LCD display symbols and their meanings briefly. Each of these can be accessed by pushing the mode button or on the two button configuration, the mode select button and cycling to your desired mode. The trip computer mode, represented by a vehicle and gas pump symbol, provides driving information such as a trip meter, fuel economy readings, distance to empty range, average vehicle speed, and various related features. The operation and features we are reviewing may vary based on your vehicle. Turn by turn, represented by a curved arrow symbol, displays the state of your vehicle's navigation, providing visual directions as you travel. The AB mode, highlighted by a musical note symbol, keeps you current on the state of your versatile AV system. The service mode, symbolized by a wrench, calculates and displays when your vehicle is due for scheduled maintenance, normally appearing either 900 miles or 30 days before the recommended appointment time. Another important symbol is that of the master warning signal. This warning light can inform you of situations such as low washer fluid, low tire pressure, the active hood lift system, and service reminders. If one of these situations occurs, the master warning light will illuminate. Once the issue is resolved, the warning light will turn off. The gear icon represents user settings, which allows you to change the settings for vehicle doors, lamps, and other items. You can scroll through the various settings by pressing the up and down select button on the right-hand side of the steering wheel. As an example, let's change the automatic door lock setting in the user settings screen. Toggle with the select button to door and select it with the enter reset button on the steering wheel. The enter reset button is characterized by an arrow icon that is almost identical to the enter key on a computer keyboard. Then toggle down to auto door lock and press the enter reset button. You can elect to have the doors automatically lock when the vehicle reaches 10 miles per hour by selecting speed or when the shift lever is moved from park to reverse, neutral or drive by selecting shift lever. Here, we select the shift lever as the automatic trigger for the door locks, simply by using the select button to toggle to that option and pressing the enter reset button. With the two button configuration control buttons found on certain models, you can scroll through the various user settings by pressing the move reset button on the right hand side of the steering wheel. For the automatic door lock function just shown, you would select it with the mode select button. Once again, we'll select the shift lever to automatically trigger the door locks. So, simply scroll to the user settings with the Mode Select button. Scroll down to Door with the Move Reset button, then press the Mode Select button to select it. Scroll down to Automatically Lock, select it with Mode Select, then scroll to Enable On Shift, and confirm with the Mode Select button. As you can see, the available LCD display offers you a variety of choices for customizing the operation of your vehicle, and the controls are right at your fingertips. For more information, always check the Kia Owner's Manual or Features and Functions Guide.